Gaga for me is the spirit. She's the Mugler witch. I want to start with that, you know, because she was my muse and I want her to be here in spirit. So we created this video and she was brilliant, you know, with her buck teeth like a rabbit with the stones and uh, she looks great. For me, it was just my memory of Mugler. We didn't go through the archive this time. We want to show something different, a different softer side of Mugler this time, and uh, we just work with our memories. What I give him a lot of credit for, I think he took the DNA of Mugler, but he totally morphed it. And I think that morphing was a key word. Those opening looks in that almost makeup flesh color, to me was almost like second skin. What I think is interesting that Nicola Formichetti has done, he's taken the codes of the house that Terry Mugler was really known for, with sculpting it to the body in a very asymmetrical sort of way, but so asymmetrical and so graphic and so modern, it almost becomes organic. the strength of the silhouettes and I love these like sort of jagged edges it was really sculptural it definitely pays homage to the heritage of the brand but also you know expresses a sort of new fresh approach that's unique and I just I thought it was a really strong collection I think it's really the best show so far from Nicola and it's very cohesive, very direct, love the flesh on flesh on flesh on flesh. And then that idea of a piece of grass or almost a blade of grass became a continuous piece of a print on some of those little asymmetrically cut gowns. So I love the tension between something that's uber modern and at the same time had that very unexpected idea of something very organic. talking with all the team about what we loved about Mugler and we just took the shoulders and the silhouette and the colors. But then I wanted to work with a blank canvas and I wanted to do something contemporary. So it was kind of my Mugler memory deconstructed. That was the starting point. I always love Mugler and I like the show, I like the two colors that he chose, but he stick to them. And I, I, I thought the shoes were amazing, I thought the hairstyling was amazing, makeup and everything. So I really liked the show, I thought it was a great success. It looked really great and the sculpting around the body it was just beautiful. I give him a lot of credit. Again, he took that DNA of Mugler, a lot of those strong sculptural shapes and gave it to us in a really new way. I want to see it in the showroom. It's great. I really liked it. Especially like the black stuff at the end. That was very evening. I love it. It was great. He's doing great. I love Nicola. He's great. those amazing leathers. When you think of Mugler, you always think of a super hot, sexy leather. That skinny pant and the perforation, it almost looked as if it was a scale of a fish. Again, that whole idea of kind of underwater was very subliminal, but you could almost feel the wave and the way that something was cut and constructed. Mm -hmm. 